Trump administration's ambitious missile defence initiative, the Golden Dome, is set to feature four layers of protection, including one in space and three on the ground. According to a US government slide presentation, the system will include 11 short-range interceptor batteries across the continental US, Alaska and Hawaii. The slides, marked with the slogan, Go Fast, Think Big, were shown to 3,000 defence contractors last week in Huntsville, Alabama. They reveal a complex defence architecture designed to meet a 2028 operational deadline set by President Donald Trump. Though estimated to cost around $175 billion, key elements of the system, such as the number of launches, interceptors, radar sites and ground stations, remain undecided. So far, Congress has allocated $25 billion in Trump's July tax and spend package, with another $45.3 billion requested in the 2026 presidential budget. The four-layer architecture includes a space-based missile warning and tracking system, along with three land-based components, missile interceptors, radar arrays, and potentially high-powered lasers. A notable addition is the proposed Next Generation Interceptor or NGI missile field in the Midwest which would complement the existing ground-based mid-course defence sites in California and Alaska. The interceptors are set to be developed by Lockheed Martin, which also manufactures the TAD and Aegis systems, both of which will form key elements of the upper layer defence network. The presentation flagged technical issues, including communication latency within the kill chain, a critical concern for rapid response. Surprisingly, companies like SpaceX, Palantir and Anduril, previously rumoured to be contenders, were not mentioned in the slide deck. The Pentagon confirmed it is sourcing input from industry, academia and national labs, but said it would be imprudent to release more data at this early stage. A key goal is to develop boost phase interception capability, striking missiles as they ascend through the atmosphere using space-based systems. Space Force General Michael Goetlein, who was recently appointed to lead the project, has 30 days to assemble his team, 60 days to deliver an initial system design, and 120 days to present a full implementation plan. These deadlines were outlined in a memo signed by Defence Secretary Pete Hegseth, according to details shared with Reuters. Inspired by Israel's Iron Dome, the US Golden Dome is far more expansive, tailored to defend a larger territory and counter more complex long-range threats. If completed, it would become the most layered missile defense system ever built by the United States.